Hello, this is Lucy Graham. Welcome to my video. We are going to talk about Kekish Credo number 61. I've called this video, Oh, What a Tangled Web We Weave. After you watch this video, could you please click on the like button below? Especially if you got some value from watching the video. Let's begin. Oki, welcome. Oh, what a tangled web we weave. Kekish Credo, number 61. Never be deceptive when trying to achieve a personal gain. Shortchanging others results in loss of self-esteem. Deception is the act of causing someone to accept something false or invalid as true or valid. Deception is defined as an untrue falsehood or the act of lying to trick someone. Is there a difference between a lie and a deception? Lying is usually verbal. People lie for many reasons such as to conceal things from others, to protect themselves from punishment, to mislead others, or even to save others from knowing a bitter reality. Deception is causing someone to believe something false. A deceitful person is someone who is untrustworthy, two-faced, or fraudulent, Deceitful words are misleading. Being called deceitful is not a compliment. Deceitful people tend to lie or deceive others. Or changing others results in loss of self-esteem. If you are shortchanged, you are being treated unfairly or dishonestly. Often you are given less than you deserve. This credo statement made me think of a famous quote from a poem by Sir Walter Scott. Oh, what a tangled web we weave when first we practice to deceive. The quote is from Scott's poem, Marmion, A Tale of Flodden Field. Lord Marmion, one of Henry VIII's courtiers, devises a scheme to implicate Clara Clare's fiancé in treason. Marmion defeats Clara's fiancé in a duel, but Clara retires to a convent rather than to endure his attentions. The tangled web quote is so true. There are pearls and consequences to lying. There are mental effects of lying. When people lie to avoid dealing with emotions or problems, the same problems continue to occur and get worse. This leads to depression and anxiety. Lies hurt relationships by damaging trust. When you are lied to, it makes you feel insecure. Your version of the truth is discredited. You feel unimportant because the person lying to you didn't value you enough to tell the truth. A habitual liar can struggle to live up to their own claims. They may experience extreme stress, trying to keep track of their falsehoods. If their lies are exposed, their relationship will be strained. And in some cases, they may face legal consequences. Here's your call to action. Subscribe to my channel below. And if you got some value from this video, please click the like button. Take a look in the description. There you will find a number of links. The first one takes you to a program where you can learn how to become a successful entrepreneur. I highly recommend that you check that one out. 
Another link will take you to a free ebook. And there's also a link where you can grab an autographed copy of my Traveling Tuesdays book. Have a great day, everyone. And don't forget to click that like button. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.